The city of Clyde will be fixing its roads without charging a single cent from its residents. Kate Texas reporter Alejandra Puente joins us now live from Clyde with more on how this project is going to play out. That's right. I'm here in Clyde where 36.3 miles worth of roads are going to have a new look in just a few years. Now the city assures us that this is something they've been budgeting for over two years. The city of Clyde will start repairs on their roads by first using an AI company, Roadbotics, that'll catalog what roads need the most work and what repairs are necessary. We're taking road segment sections every 10 foot. It does a AI generated um, printout of what our road conditions are, whether it's top coat of the asphalt that needs to be replaced or the uh, subgrade in the base material that needs to be uh, replaced. Clyde City Manager Chris McGuire tells us they're going to fix the roads themselves. What we plan on doing, and we've allocated it in the budget, is roughly three miles a year worth of asphalt. Um, the benefit of doing it that way is we're going to target the streets that are in the most need of repair immediately. The city of Clyde has already purchased the paving equipment and the lay down machine that cost them a little more than $550,000, but it will overall cut the total cost of the repairs. Given the market price between 90 and 100,000 a mile, um, on the top end we'd be looking at 3.65 million versus a million a mile to do it at 36 to 40 million, depending on what bids would potentially come in at. So it's a significant cost savings. McGuire tells us this won't raise a single cent for residents who expressed that concern a year ago. Well, I feel like that'd be good, you know, that they would uh, spend the money to get the equipment to do it themselves. That way it might be a little more cost efficient. They are expecting to receive the laydown machine in June to be able to hopefully get the roads fixed in less than a decade. Over the course of the next five to seven years, everything will be repaved and then uh, we should get a useful life cycle of about 30 years. Now, McGuire also told us that they are in the talks with other nearby towns about using that purchased equipment to fix even more roads. For now, here in Clyde, construction is programmed to get started in late summer, early fall. Reporting live in Clyde, Alejandra Puente, K Texas News. Alejandra, thank you. We want to know your thoughts about roads in the area. Tell us about your driving experiences and traffic conditions here in the big country. And we'll do a special report about these issues. You can share your photos and videos with us by scanning the QR code on your screen, or you can email us at news at ktxs.com.